Hi guys. So if you feel it in your heart and you think you would like to support my channel, go check out the Patreon page down below. Have a wonderful meditation. Thank you. Are you ready to meditate with Corey? Lay down, my little friend, and close your eyes. It's time for a very special story. Make sure that you're still. listening. In a land far, far away. In a place where no people live. A place in the middle of the earth. There is a very special this land is covered in animals, sacred animals, that all have meaning, that are all connected to the planet in one form or another, they all have a purpose. The tree that I'm referring to is thousands and thousands and thousands of years old. No one knows about this tree, but I know. I'm sharing the secret with you right now as you get ready to fall to sleep. This magical tree, this ancient tree is known as the dreamer. It's a dream tree. The dream tree holds every single person's dreams on the entire planet in its leaves and its branches. Every dream is seen as a twinkling light, one single light. The tree is so, so bright. It's brighter than the sun, brighter than the stars in the sky, brighter than any light here on earth. It's a very magical tree. With your eyes closed, imagine its roots in your mind. Its roots go all the way to the middle of the earth. of the earth, the center of the planet. Its roots 
spread out for miles and miles in all different directions underneath the ground. There's magical energy in the core of the earth and the dream tree feeds off the energy. The energy gives it power to grow, gives it strength to hold the weight of every single dreamer's dream. It's a very special ancient tree. Every night when you dream, when you close your eyes, relax your body and allow yourself to drift into dreamland. Your dream goes out into the world, out up into the sky, up past the stars and the moon and all of the planets. Your dream flies up all the way around the world until it finds itself falling onto the dream tree just like a raindrop. Your dream falls onto the leaves falls on to the special magical branches and becomes part of this wonderful tree. Your dream becomes part of a leaf along with many, many other dreams from other children all over the world. The leaf gets bright, shiny, and heavy, very, very heavy. dream falls to the ground as the leaf falls to the ground. The leaf slowly over time decays and becomes part of the soil and the earth at the base of the tree. The dream then travels deep into the soil. Your dream travels deep into the earth, flows down deep into the roots of the magical dream tree. Flows down miles and miles, going on and on for what seems like a very, very long time. On a journey going deep into the middle of the earth where no one ever goes, only your magical dream. When your dream gets into the middle of the earth, the very core of the planet, along with billions 
and trillions of other dreams from beings all over the world. It does a very special thing. Your dream is whispered in the ears of Mother Earth herself. She hears your dream whispering to her through the roots of the dream dream. She hears the dreams just like we hear music, all different tunes, sounds, vibrations, happy dreams, sad dreams, scary dreams. She hears them all calling to her, whispering to her. She loves every single dream. She hears every single dream. She takes the energy and the vibration of your very special dream and sends it through the earth and then she uses your dream to grow the grass to grow the trees she uses your dream to flow deep into the ocean Your dream is in the air, it travels in the wind, it settles and rests in the big, white, fluffy clouds. Your dream is everywhere, in everything that you look at here on Mother Earth. Your dream that you dream every night is all around you talking back to you and eventually coming true all the things that you wish for in the dream the good things in the world. She takes those and sends them out in the wind, out over the ocean. They travel all around the world and eventually come back when it's at the right time. The scary things that we dream about she takes a hold of those and cradles them in her arms as if they were scared little babies. She turns them into smiles and sends them out on the backs of all the birds that fly all around the world. takes the bad dreams and fills them with love. And then when it rains, 
all the new dreams come down from the sky, fall down onto the branches and the leaves of the dream tree. They feed her with the water and the light from the sun and she grows and grows. She's the tallest tree in the world. And when our leaves get heavy and full, they fall off, fall to the ground. They decay into the earth, deep, deep down into the soil, and start their journey all over again, all the way down, deeper and deeper. Traveling for miles and miles. Until they reach the middle of the earth. One more time. Where Mother Earth sits and listens to the whispers and the callings of all the dreams. From all of you. The cycle goes on and on. It's been going on and on many, many, many years. the chance to visit the dream tree, you would be able to sit at the base of a tree, close your eyes and listen. Listen just like Mother Earth listens. You would hear all the adventures, all the magical laughter, the places where we go in our minds when we fall to sleep, those places that no one ever knows. You would hear all of that as you sit still. base of the dream tree. Your body would connect to the ground and the soil and you would start to hear of the magical language, dreams that could be millions of years old. You may even hear one of your dreams 
a dream from long ago. Listen in the silence. Far, far away.